We're actually planning to go on vacation soon and with that I've been talking to friends and family and we've been talking about motion sickness. I suffer from motion sickness really bad and with the conversation a lot of people haven't realized there's other things you can do other than just motion sickness tablets. So because of that I thought this would be a great video to share with you guys my motion sickness preventative routine. So there's five things that I do to help. So the first two are really basic. The first one, be hydrated. Um, and I'm not talking I'm going to get in a car or I'm going to go take a flight somewhere and downing a bottle of water. I'm talking for a couple days up to it, make sure your fluids are up to par, make sure you're not dehydrated in any way. If you are dehydrated, you're going to feel more, more motion sickness quicker. It's one thing I've found in the past. I've thought, oh, I'm going for a long car ride. I'm not going to eat or drink anything because I want my stomach to be empty and then it made it worse. So that leads me to the second thing. You should eat. And um, not a big meal and not nothing. Probably just small light meals up to your trip or if you're going to an amusement park. You don't want your stomach to be empty and you don't want it to be overly full. So those are the first two things. The third thing is you might have noticed these straps on my hand. Um, there's, it actually is two. They're called C-bands. There is a little pressure point uh, bead on the inside and they're just stretchy wristbands. You put them on both your wrists and it goes on your pressure point and that helps relieve motion sickness. I use these on long car rides, I use these on airplane flights, and if I were to go to an amusement park I would throw these on as well. So that's number three. The fourth thing is the obvious. Let's take gravel, okay? Um, in the States I believe it's Dramamine. In Canada we have gravel. Now I use a specific kind of gravel. The regular gravel, fine. Regular Dramamine, fine. Um, I have had no luck with the natural ginger gravel. I don't know if maybe I took it too late or if it's just not good for me. It did work. I was really motion sickness uh, the last time I tried it in the car and it was not a good scene. So the one that I use is this one and I'm not endorsing any, I'm not working for a company, this is just the one I choose. It's the Gravol, it's immediate release and long active caplets. And I'll just show you, I don't know if you can see. They're, they're kind of uh, a white and a pink. So the first half of them works right away, calms your stomach, makes you feel good. And then the other half of it lengthens that out. So I take these before I go anywhere and they are godsend. So that's step four and you can choose whatever works for you. This is just works for me. And the fifth thing that a lot of people don't know about and I'm not sure if it's just a Canadian thing or not. I go to my local shoppers drug mart. You can pretty much go to any drugstore that I know of and you can get these. They are called Transderm V um, their transdermal therapeutic system prevents motion sickness for up to three days. So I'll just show you that. I don't know if that's zooming in or not. Okay, so these are, oh, let me get, the, get it out for you. So you get two patches. That's all that comes in the box is two patches. And I don't know if you can see it. I'll zoom it in there but you put the patch right here on that bone behind your ear. Um, and I believe it, it is, oh, quickly. Um, here I'm reading the instructions as I'm working with you. I used to know this off by heart. Okay, so you put it behind one ear for 12 hours before you need it, and then it may be left on for three days. So if you know that you're planning on going to an amusement park, throw this on the day before. Um, it, obviously if you have a scheduled flight, if you're going out on a Friday night, put it on you know, Thursday night or even early Friday morning. You want 12 hours on before you try going out anywhere. Um, and then you can leave it on for three days. We actually went for a long road trip a couple summers ago and I put it on before we left and we just went for like a, a two night stay somewhere. So I just left it on the whole time I was gone. Um, it does only come 
two in a package. It is $14 in Canada, uh, which seems really pricey because it ends up being about $7 a patch. But if you suffer from motion sickness, you don't care. You would spend a lot more than $14, trust me. So this is my number five to my five step plan of not getting motion sickness. And this has been the absolute best. I don't always combine the two. If I'm doing a small trip, it's this, like in the car or sometimes the plane. Um, but if I'm doing an amusement park and actually probably every time I do fly, I use these patches. They are amazing. They really work. Um, you just put one on, carry on. You can wash, you can swim. It doesn't come off until you actually pull it off. But there is some side effects and I actually found that out the hard way. I put my patch on once and then I must have rubbed my eye and my one pupil relaxed and dilated and not the other, which kind of messed up my vision for a little bit. But once I took it off and washed out my eye, it was fine. But always read the side effects and always wash your hands after you put one on. So that's it guys. Hydrate, light meal, sea bands, which again, you can get these at Walmart, Target, and any uh, drugstore. Gravel, and then the transderm patch if you can. These transderm patches, I just wanted to let you know, if you do go and get one from your local pharmacy or drugstore, um, you do have to go up to the counter, the drugstore counter, um, and ask for them. It's over the counter. It's not going to be on the shelf by the gravel. You actually have to go ask the pharmacist and you can get it from them. Okay? If you have any questions, put them down in the comments below and I'll try to get to them as soon as possible. I hope you liked my video and I hope that it helps you with your motion sickness. It can really ruin a trip, um, so I really hope this helps you. Have a great day. Bye!